Now, it's no longer news that exercise is very good for the body. But I know with this busy schedule that we all have, and the fact that we need to conscious, consciously put food on our tables, that there's so less time for exercise and doing some routines. But it's important for us to know that as busy as we are, we should not neglect our health. Because when the need for that health comes knocking, every other thing backs down. Now, what are the tips that we can use to just ensure that we have this regular exercise routine, either as a business person, either as a creator, an entrepreneur, whatever you might be doing as a task or your source of income. Now, I've been in both worlds, been in the private and in the public sector and also in, in my own business. So I understand what it means when you have to squeeze out time from the little time you have for yourself to sleep, to bond with your kids, family time, and also to be able to keep abreast or in shape with your health. But before we go into that, what exactly are the benefits of exercise? Now, this is an early morning walk before the sun comes up, but it's already bright in the day. What it does is that the little um, the glucose stored from the yesterday's food would try increase the metabolism. That's what exercise does. It increases the metabolism of the food that you've eaten prior, and it also helps to get your body ready in full gear for the day's activity. Now, exercise has been known to reduce risks of cardiac diseases, stroke, hypertension, diabetes, um, even um, mind control issues. When you're talking about psychosis, depression, there is a surge of um, happy hormones. Let me put it that way so it doesn't get confusing. Happy hormones, anytime you take a walk, a jog, a run, or even do exercises in the gym. You might not be privileged to have a gym around you, but you can create uh, early morning walk. Like for example, this morning, I took my son over to the school and I decided to walk home. You could also look at the options of probably um, where you're coming back from work. Instead of the vehicle to take you directly into your apartment or the front of your home, you could stop two bus stops before you get to your home and then walk the way through that for example for those who probably travel light when they go to work is very ideal at least those two minutes three minutes five minutes of walking every day is very important now the most important thing is consistency because the more you do it the more you get used to it you might start the exercise and think, oh, until I'm off or I'm on leave before I can even do an exercise believe me if you're not doing it when you're not free then you might not be able to do it when you're free it's just the nature of human body you just want to lay on your bed and press your phone and just click away but it's important to ensure that your health is also very succulent follow me for more information as we keep digging deep into healthy lifestyle my name is nurse abiodun i'm a creative nurse abby and i talk about nursing i talk about lifestyle and i talk about everything in between see you soon bye for now